Hey, this is your girl, Miss I Am Everything, aka the Web Mistress. Follow me on Instagram, Google Plus, Black Planet, MySpace, and Twitter. I do not have a Facebook or Snapchat. I said I was gonna do a little story time today, based off of uh, what happened with uh, Khloe Kardashian and Tristan and Jordan Woods. People I don't know, um, but everyone's talking about it. Um, I have my own little story based on how things go with sisters and boyfriends, so I figured I would just bring it up, which I had never told nobody before. Well, I have, but just not a lot of people. Um, I have a sister. I have several, actually, but one of them that was closest to me is three years younger than me, and once upon a time, she had a boyfriend, and I lived alone, but she still stayed with my mother and her baby at the time. Um, she wanted me to meet the new boyfriend. I invite them over to my house. I meet the boyfriend. Cool. You know, general introductions when you dating somebody sort of thing. And by me living on my own, you know, I would go out of town and I need someone to be at my house. I let her and her boyfriend stay over there. Fast forward to maybe a year or so later. Um, I just noticed the guy staring at me a certain kind of way and she would mention certain things about my body. Oh, my sister's this. My sister's built this way. Blah, blah, blah. You know, that sort of thing gets a man curious. He might not even have been thinking like that, but... You know, he called me out of the clear blue sky. It was like 2 in the morning. And he started telling me about uh, how he think his uh, girlfriend's cheating on him. And I let him know my sister's not that type of person and blah, blah, blah. Then the conversation deviated to I was attractive and how curvy and busty I am. And it made me think of the things that my sister told him, which got him interested. Oh, so I didn't like the way the conversation was going. I told him I was going to tell my sister about this. And we got on the phone. The next day, and she left her job and came to my house. I showed her his number on my caller ID as an incoming call. And she left. I guess he said I tried to come on to him, even though his number's on my phone as incoming call. And like most stupid women, they believe what the man say. And we didn't talk for six years after that. But um, back to Jordan and Chloe. You know, you should never be hanging out with your sister's man, or best friend's sister's man to begin with or however, whatever, there's a hundred million other men for her to deal with, and there's a hundred million other women for him to deal with. Who knows how it happens, but, you know, a lot of people either was jumping on, um, uh, the Woods girl, I forgot her name that damn fast, let's show how important celebrities are to me, Jordan, how, um, either people was bashing her for what happened or jumping on her side, and I figure, like, a lot of people would either side with the woman or jump on the woman. But nobody said anything about the guy. It's really sad. And it just made me think about my sister and our relationship had deteriorated over the years after that. It's kind of like you're damned if you do and you're damned if you don't. Had I not told my sister what happened and ignored it, I would have been blamed. I got blamed because I did tell her. So it's like... <laughs> so moving forward, I just knew not to ever be around any of my friends, boyfriends. None of my sister's boyfriends, I don't have them around mine. Because, you know, stuff happens and fingers are pointed. And it's just best to remove yourself totally before that sort of situation even happens. But that's my little story time on my YouTube. And I'm sure if any of you all have went through the same thing, feel free to comment. And uh, I'd like to hear from guys that have been in a similar situation whose brother may have messed with his baby mama. Or maybe your best friend, your girlfriend messed with your best friend's brother or whoever. I would like to hear from other people that have been through the same situation, especially, you know, just get some dialogue going and figure out how we all can avoid situations like that. I know how to avoid situations like that. Hopefully the rest of you people know how to as well. But this has been your girl, the web mistress, aka Miss I Am Everything. Holla.